I hear the Lord saying, it's time to wake up. It's time for the world to wake up. It's time for the church to wake up. The Bible said in the book of Hosea chapter 4 verse 6 that my people are destroyed because of lack of knowledge because they have rejected knowledge. It didn't just say my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, but the Bible going to say because they have rejected it, they didn't want it. They didn't want to hear it. This tragic event that happened concerning Kobe Bryant. We all love Kobe Bryant. Actually, he was my second favorite basketball player next to Michael Jordan. But right now, and me as a preacher of the gospel, got to state the facts. Get to the point. Many NBA stars are Masons. I would the Illuminati's. Somebody said, well, Preacher Warren, what that had to do with it? When you make a deal with the devil, the devil requires sacrifice. It's hard as it may sound, but it's true. He may tell you to sacrifice your loved one. I even sacrifice yourself just for fame and fortune, just to get popular and well-known around the world. Most Hollywood stars, actually all Hollywood stars, are devil worshippers. Even in NBA, many of you are throwing up Illuminati signs and 666 signs. Uh, 666, I said too many numbers. <laughs> Which doesn't really matter because it's still demonic. It's all, it all represents devil worship to pyramid sign. Now, Kobe Bryant, who we love so much, and I'm praying for his family and his children, is so sad. But let's face the facts. We're not trying to preach doom. We're trying to help you. My job as a preacher of the gospel, as well as other preachers' job, is to preach to save souls. Only God can save a soul. But you got to want to be saved. When you sell your soul to Satan, the devil requires you to work for him. Kobe Bryant put out a book about witchcraft and black magic. Okay? To teach children how to practice witchcraft and Satanism at an early age. So the demons jump off on, on children and possess these little kids at an early age. Now, since it's tragic, this book is going to go famous. Okay, it was a cartoon that was put out about him in 2016 that he was going to die and be killed in a helicopter accident. That means Kobe Bryant already knew this was going to happen. I find it very strange how LeBron James broke Kobe Bryant's record and then the next day Kobe Bryant got killed in a, in a helicopter accident. Don't you find that very strange? Kobe Bryant was wearing a sneak, not Kobe Bryant, LeBron James wore a sneaker that night, a very dark looking sneaker, saying Kobe, uh, Mama for Life, which was Kobe Bryant, Mama for Life, he was called the Mama, Mama, Mama for Life. Now Kobe Bryant was only 41 years old, but the way it said on, that, on LeBron James' sneaker, it looked like they knew that he was going to die. It looked like death, that sneaker looked very eerie. I'm going to show it on cable TV because I'm on cable TV now. In Manhattan Channel. God has raised me up now in the television world. And one day I'm going to get on radio. And then there was a, and one of his teammates wore a t-shirt of Kobe Bryant as a skeleton burning in hell. Now you can't tell me that's a coincidence. How is it the next day Kobe Bryant got killed in a helicopter accident? It was the Illuminati's that sacrificed him. The deal he made with the devil was up. We don't want to think these things bad things about a person because we love these people. But we must face the facts. The Bible said the soul that sin is shall die. When you make a deal with the devil, when the deal is up, the devil comes to collect. God don't want to see you go to hell. If we're going to talk about heaven, we must warn people about hell. We're not trying to condemn you to hell. We don't want to see these bad things happen to people. There's not no hate preaching. There's not no doom preaching. We're trying to help you. A lot of preachers are preaching for money. They're not going to tell you the truth. All they want is your money. For those of you who are alive, come to Jesus. Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for their misses of sin, and they shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. God bless you.